Hey guys, welcome to another episode of the Hype Plane where we get the latest star season news as they drop. Today we got the roadmap roundup for November 9th and we're going to get right into it. Right before we get started, I'd like to give a shout out to all my channel members and Patreon. Thank you guys very much for your continued support. So we got the roadmap roundup uh, for this Wednesday and there's a few notable changes that I wanted to quickly get to you guys. All right, and the very first one that they're saying is um, the time travel, the time trail uh, race mission has been added as a card for 318 in the release field. Okay, so that means there's going to be time trials in the initial release of 318. We did see some details on this in the leaks. If you haven't seen my leaks video, make sure you check those out. All right, in addition to this is the Gen 12 uh, renderer. They did talk about this um, in one of the most recent Inside Star Citizens and it's really interesting, uh, an interesting video to watch as uh, initially it's going to give us some performance improvements, hopefully, but definitely in the future once they're able to optimize and en enable Vulcan, we are going to see some performance improvements. All right, so um, up next is um, this feature here has uh, passed its final review for 318. So it's been set to committed is the sandbox prison activities. All right. So it says expansion of prison gameplay with new uh, with a new suite of missions and sandbox activities to give the inmates more opportunities to earn merits or to aid in their escape from prison. So that's going to be interesting for those that are into that gameplay everybody's going to eventually end up in jail so it's always awesome to have more things to do once in prison okay so the very next one is for the progress tracker they have added the crusader spirit series to the progress tracker which is really cool it's a cool ship that i'm also looking forward to and i cannot wait to finally see that last but not least they have removed the anvil legion as there are some gameplay dependencies from Squadron 42 before they can re-add it to the progress tracker. Hey, I got some really cool leaks in this video right here. Make sure you do not miss it. I'll see you on that video.